Welcome to a TLDR Wrath Guide for Professor Putricide. For anyone who wanted a Futurama and WoW crossover event, Putricide is the final boss of the Playworks and has three health-based phases. Take three tanks, unless your DPS is higher than my ping on hardcore classic servers, and at the start of the fight, have one drink the potion on the table to become uglier than usual. His job is to eat any of the slime puddles that spawn under players before they get too big. Throughout phase one and two, the boss alternates summoning a green or orange ad from the sides of the room, which both need to be killed ASAP. The green one immobilizes and fixates someone and explodes if it reaches them, dealing a shitload of damage split between anyone hit and knocking them away. The orange one also fixates someone, but they can move, giving 10 stacks of a dot that drops every tick. If it reaches them, they explode for raid-wide damage, so kite like you'll be kicked if it goes off. Hold the boss near the greed pipe, and when the green one spawns, everyone swap and kill it ASAP. And if it fixates a melee player, the explosion won't be as bad. The A-bomb tank should help using regurgitated ooze, a 50% slow so they can be kited and killed easier. And if there are no adds or ooze puddles, just attack the boss. On Heroic, you also get Unbound Plague, a ramping dot that lasts a minute and can only be removed by passing it off on someone. Once you've had it though, you can't take it again for another minute, otherwise you'll probably f***ing die. Assign a group of tanky range to be dot holders and stand away from the raid to pass it around amongst themselves. And if the dot starts in melee, get out of the raid ASAP and give it to the group. At 80%, the boss stuns everyone, including the ads, and starts phase 2. On heroic though, you don't get stunned. Instead, the boss summons both ads at the same time and gives everyone a debuff so you can only attack one of them. Don't push the boss while the other ads are alive or you'll be dealing with three. Save some CDs and blast them down and the A-bomb tank should prio slowing the green ad. Phase 2 is similar to phase 1, but with a few additions. Malleable Goo is a bouncing ball towards a few players so don't get hit, and choking gas bombs are small clouds that explode after 20 seconds or if you stand on them. They also reduce your hit chance by 75%, so unless you want to be as useless as trying to get me to call Twitter by any other name, move away from the clouds. Keep going the same as Phase 1 until 35% when you start Phase 3. The ads will stop spawning and the A-bomb tank returns to normal, and this is where you want to pop last. You can't get rid of the slime anymore, so move the boss around the room when more spawns. The boss now gives tanks Mutated Plague, a stacking debuff that deals ticking raid-wide damage, and if you go above 4 stacks, you'll probably all f***ing die. If the tank dies or drops the debuff, the boss heals itself for a shitload, so manage keeping the debuff up by rotating tanks after each hit. Kill the boss before the damage gets too high or you run out of room. On Heroic, manage Unbound Plague as best you can while moving, but it is more of a YOLO approach to keep it enraged. During the Heroic transition ads, you can either pop everything to destroy the ads or save them for the boss as you still need a shitload of damage to kill him before you all die from the tank debuff. And that's it for Professor Putricide. Congrats on your kill. One of the more complicated bosses so far, but I'm sure you'll be just fine. Like and subscribe if you found this useful I'll catch you in the next one.